Enigma versus Liquid. Uh, it's going to be a, a very exciting start to, to the Major Healer cost. They get any sort of rotation around towards the mid. You know, are gonna have that skill set to really set up. Top lane. All right, man. Trying to get in onto Insane and not quite enough to finish him off. Oh, bottom lane. There it is. And this time round, we are and Kura able to finish off the kill. Tiger, he's trying to go for we. Is he going to be able to find himself? Oh, the sound. We are going to be able to keep himself alive, but the roll four from Tiger will secure the trade. A lot of potential here from this puck. I mean, his farm still can ping flawless. Roll on the top lane. We're going to get some moves here coming in. The kickback as well with the rupture combo. Iron Man taking huge amounts of damage here from Boxy and Tiger as uh, he will slowly but surely go down. The rotation has been made. Miracle's here, but Big K's there Doom as well. Coil. Two coil down onto the two of the Miracle. Locked in position, taken out. Now with Tiger's further control, they'll finish off Kuroki. Man, Puck is just an uh, insanely good hero, even though they like have counters, Lion, throughout um, the DPC and all other regions top, top lane. We, he's going to drop. And he's gone. Kuro, is he going to be able to get his way out of it? Tiger, he's looking for the angle, won't find it with the roll free, but he finds it with the kick. Able to slow down Kuro and set up a second kill for Boxy up top. It's now 9-4, to four, 6k lead here for Liquid. It's not going to be easy anymore for, even with the backup of GH, to enable Miracle enough to actually get in, get kills without putting his own life at risk. Top lane. Yeah, problem is they don't have that one initiator, someone who can start the fight. Mickey, he's going in, doesn't even use the coil. He's able to just right click down Weeha. They'll turn over towards Iron Man as well. It's just kills here for Liquid. The back of a GH by his side. Be enough to stop Liquid from diving any further. Top lane. There's the spirit vest. So, like, Dragonite's not going to be that tanky. No, not at all. Let's get torn through here by the damage of Quake. Uh, Tiger coming in as well to offer that extra bit of a punch. He'll pop the hood, RMN. He's going to try and stand his ground, go for the TP out. Is he away? He is. Not quite able to get back in on top of him, Tiger, to take him down in time as RMN will live to see another day. And now, the turnaround comes into play. Chains out onto Tiger. He'll punish the Earth Spirit. Kuro trying to set up for more, but Mika jumps across, coil down onto Kuroki. Do land the stuns on this Bloodseeker there. Just struggle. Damage to take him out. Mid lane. Miracle getting jumped by the Dream Core. Tiger's in, but Kuro is able to tap the stun out on two of the Valor Strike. Out on the three. They're taking they him again. Game. They're moving on to Tiger. They're going to have the damage to take Tiger out as well. Two down. Boxy, could he turn things around? Blood right out. Two of them that attempted to TP out there by We Are. And Kuro is immediately put to a stop for his boxy has got the Box damage. Boxy's going to clean him up. Double kill for the Bloodseeker. They have so much overtime damage. There you go, it's a bit chilly. Get cloak on. Uh, that's but... not a cloak of Invis, you know, that's not a Harry Potter cloak. We got here, Tiger. Okay, he's gonna come in with a backup. It ends up being just a bit of a bait from Tiger. As Tiger's gonna be fine. They've committed in on him. We're gonna see if they can find Miracle here in the trees, and they can. They've got the lockdown, they have the damage. They try and close up whilst they do have this significant advantage. I think Liquid should just try to take another fight, uh, get a kill or two, transition that into Roche, Radiant using a scan inside the pit to see what's going on. Oh, and Mickey, he jumped in, he's gone aggressive. There's four heroes here, Mickey, what's he doing? I mean, that's a bit of a that's similar just, play like, to as he done earlier. He can't yeah. afford to do these sort of moves, Lukov. It's a lot of gold. It's a lot of experience. He's high level, level 17 at the moment. Trying to farm up that Lincoln Sphere, so there's not going to be Blink Initiation. There was also uh, RMN with his Blink Dagger. He's uh, Dragonite's tanky, not that tanky against the Spirit Vessel, so he's going to be brought down once again. Get aggressive with these BKBs or just sort of have to put another a bit of slow on it. Now yeah, you still want to uh, take uh, possibly a fight. Uh, there's a tier one tower on the bottom so they can TP, but if someone gets caught, uh, someone that's not Puck, let's see who's TPing. Yeah, it's actually going to be Mickey. Tiger. Set things up. Iron Man does it the back up on the side, but Mickey's quick to jump over onto Kuroki. Kuroki will fall. Tiger trying to hunt for more. Okay, as well, seeing if you can get any further catch. Iron Man, he's going to have Blink up in a second. He may just be able to get his way out of this. Miracle. Oh, he wants to go in, not out at this point. Something like that. Getting a little split up, though. Weeha He's going to need some backup. Does always have the option of BKBing and TPing out. He's going to put the BKB in. He's just going to try and commit, get the life still going. He's going to try and channel the ult, but he's taking huge amounts of damage. Can he really stay alive? He can't. It's enough from Liquid to take him out, even through the BKB, as they're able to combo him. So low that by the time he got the BKB off, he only had a few hundred more HP to work with. He's gonna step out, quite for have a bit of a poke at this. At this point, I think you can like kill Venomancer because he's way too tanky. He has that the spell lifesteal, has a four staff for RMN. 
Try and chase him down here, the two of them. Gale connects. He's going to go out with a TP in Kuro. And make Just sure that TP safe. out. It's that easy. So yeah, Venomancer, they can't really kill Venomancer unless they like commit with the three, four heroes possibly. There's the rupture. See we are. Stands his ground. PKP's out, finger down onto Tiger. Nigma's in a position where can't, they can't make any aggressive moves. So we are. Got the BKB. It's uh, Mickey. And he's gonna have the answer for that dream coil down. We are having top to stand his ground, try and get the Jinku stacks built up, but Mickey kites him up. Be able to take him out. Also, Liquid managed to sneak in a ward inside Nigma's base, so that's going to give them a lot of information where they're moving. Chasing on to Kuro, Tiger. We'll jump straight in. Pop his own BKB out. Kuro does manage to get the knife from RMN, so RMN at least able to take a, a bit of the benefit away from Liquid. Liquid, they'll just turn their attention towards RMN instead now, though. The Will O Wisp does get locked down, and now Tiger, he's going to be caught underneath the tower. Can he get himself Good out blinding of the Tiger will fall. But they've lost three on Nigma. Miracle having to put the BKB to get out of the, the coils down from Mickey. Mickey and Boxe, they want to jump in and die for this. They've managed to get in as the fan and take out GH. They're going to be able to find Miracle as well as Liquid. They'll clean up all five of them. Didn't really allow Nigma to do too much. <laughs> Nigma still very much on the back foot. You see the jump in there. They're able to come in and on to Mickey, keeping him locked down underneath uh, the Will O Wisp. He's able to get the face shift out. Mickey can't escape. He can't. Mickey goes down. Nigma there, and they're able to hold their ground. Uh, Boxy can get the cleanup though. Blood right down as RMN's brought incredibly low roll across from Tiger. He's able to put a stop to the attempted escape by Weeha. Mickey may have fallen. Liquid with Boxy at the helm. No struggle. Priest range on those attacks. What do you do here if you're Nigma? How do you stop this? How do you slow it down? To make a bit of a poke on to Boxy. It is not an easy kill. KB and Aegis, you've got to deal with this incredibly far Bloodseeker twice. Roll four from Tiger will be put to a stop by the Boundless Strike of Weeha. Miracle getting a little scared though, just pop the BKB himself. So now he's going to be vulnerable and Mickey knows it. Straight in with the Dream Coil down onto the two of them. He'll get the Wukong's command out. Try and keep Miracle alive, but Foxy's in with the BKB. He sees him, takes him down as Miracle's out of the game. No buyback. So is Kuro. Two are down. Liquid. They seize the opportunity to dive in. Insania. Oh, Insania is in. in the freezing field as they can't deal with the Crystal Maiden now at this point even. Buyback still don't want to take the fight. Uh, very limited on the damage right now. Like Crystal Maiden, uh, I think she's more farmed than the Monkey King at this point. Certainly seems to be a 40,000 lead here for Liquid is finally putting it into play to close it up. We are trying to slow things down, but at least until Miracle's back up, Nigma's just not going to have a chance of bringing anything. They've found him. They've cut down his tree. They're straight in as Tiger kicks him back into the clutches of the rest of Team Liquid. We are will fall out of the game for 100 seconds and Liquid, they're not done yet. Rolling over towards the fountain, making sure that Kuroki and RMN can't get back to safety. And this is going to be Mega Creeps. Up to save, so not going to feel the damage. Or, uh, same goes for Grow is a passive ability. So, like, you use your combo, you wait. You wait until it resets. While we're talking, GH and RMN managed to get a kill on the top lane. Of course, over the Brace of Fairy Fire Stick, a couple of points in the Dragon's Blood. Pretty tanky. Tanky enough though, Tiger able to find find the positioning there to get that perfect toss. Gets the catch and the setup onto Miracle. Tiger makes the moves and doesn't need to worry too much about mana. And you also like want to get something that gives you mana top lane, GH. But Liquid is quite for now starting to get involved in the action. Level six can start putting pressure onto this tower. And Iron Man's got to be careful. He's going to get the stun off. And the bear is in. And RMN, he's gone. That's a double kill, and something that usually does not happen, like uh, your offlane tower being pressured, like look how low it is. And it's also just the Nyx Assassin. Coil. Yep, Mickey and Tiger, they're straight around to the back lines. Coil dropped down onto the Coil and Kuroki, he's out. GH as well, tossed in position. As Liquid, they'll find the two of them. This top they tower, they attempt to defend it. But no defense can really be put in place at all. What is he bringing? He's bringing stick, infused raindrop, and a couple more clarities. Bottom lane. This is a tough kill to get. See if they've got enough damage. The link building up. Boxy. A box is just baiting. Okay. In the pubs, I've seen it like on the offlane tusk as well. 
it synergizes nicely with, let's say, Grimstroke's uh, Ink Swallow V. Is he Trump? dead? Yeah, he looks pretty dead. And he looks pretty dead. It's been a slow start for Enigma. And now Meb Mikkei. They go for the setup onto the two of them with the Dream Core Tiger. Coming in, looking for the toss back. He's got it. Breaks the just coil just time. in time. Uh, I mean, it, 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 you don't get any closer with that sort of timing. The Dream Coil lasting just long enough for Tiger to still find that chance to, to get that combo out with the toss. Mid. GH. Trying to go in, but he's been silenced. Mickey, he's getting low. The static link from we will allow them to finish him off. Toss. Tiger sends him in very deep. We are still healthy enough to, to back off safely. Liquid not able to commit on him. And now we are turning over towards Tiger. I'll chase him down. Tiger, is he going to... Oh, he's going to dodge it. Oh, I see what he did there. You know, he's just keeping the scores. Uh, 007, Agent Tiger, licensed to assist. Slow down this siege, but Tiger's back in. And he, you know, he's looking for a catch. He's heading over. GH will be able to stop him for now with the Spike Carapace. Miracle trying to stand his ground with the Dragon Tail stun onto Tiger, but Boxy is just going to start chasing them all down. Quite for bringing the bear in from the side. Miracle held in the Chakram. The coil is back up and is slammed down onto the two of them. Catches Miracle, catches GH, and now over towards Kuro. Boxy goes and he's able to find him in the trees as well. Three more kills for Liquid. Miracle just can't catch a break. I, I don't think they kill him unless they get like a full static link. We, we've seen the combo in the previous fight. Our man using the ink swell and one of the necro warriors oh, coil again. Urkel and GH they set forward, but immediately Mickey turns, drops the ult. GH will buy a bit of safety with the stun out onto the two of them, but they're diving in onto Miracle. The Dragon Knight falls. GH he'll also be unable to escape as Mickey jumps in. Moxie finishes him off. Top Miracle. Pop the ults here, TP's coming in. We are. He's gonna go for the easy link onto Insania, but the toss nice back toss Tiger's back. able to save him. Gets Insania back underneath the tower. GH tries to get him with a combo, but Mickey blows him up. Dream Core down and onto We Are Miracles, heading in with the Dragonfall. They've got the silence, the sword by lockdown onto Mickey. It's enough. They bring down the puck. They quit. Are they gonna continue to try and fight Boxing on without with Mickey? Nice looks, looks like they're certainly gonna try for it as Boxy's in. Toss onto Koi for getting it straight in onto the front lines, over onto Weeha, as Weeha will get caught out. The rest of Enigma, they're able to back off in time. Philosopher Stone found out. One of my favorite items. See mid. Boxy. You know, he's just in. He just, he's just in there on his own. He knows it's going to take so long for them to kill him. There's more than enough time for the rest of Liquid to turn up and try and turn things around. And saying you're dropping out the freezing field. Miracle getting low. Mickey, is he able to finish him off with a bit of burst? He is. As Miracle goes down, so does GH. As Liquid, they're diving in for more. Tiger getting the toss up, throwing quite for spare, straight in over towards We Are. Tiger will fall, but Liquid, they're just finding the cleanup here with three dead. Boxy even diving up to the high ground. He won't be able to quite have the damage to finish off We Are. Quite for over oh, to the they side. they found the Keeper of the Light as well. Root, Fear, dead. No, not at all. Definitely a, a, a tough lineup to play from behind. And you know, not not to, sort of the same way as we saw in Game 1. You know, there very much was the sense there. Right, game 1, they get the BKBs. They may have a chance of fighting despite the, the huge gold deficit. This game is much tougher for Nygma. But we'll see them get the, the, the best shot here is Miracle. He's up to the high ground. They're able to find the jump in onto Tiger. They do take Ain't him out. Buyback. But now the coil's out. Mickey's able to trap the two of them by the outpost. Time being brought for the extra TPs to come in. Boxy just charging in over towards Miracle. Takes him out with the timber chain. The avalanche combo coming crashing down onto Weeha. As Liquid find three. They're not done yet. Whipping down RMN. If they'll slow him in position. Surround him with the timber saw. As RMN, he's out as well. Four dead on Nygma. Like, why was too farmed? Like, he, I mean, he has is, yeah. too many items. 17,000 net worth. The second hero, the, actually the most farmed hero for Nygma is Razor with only 10,000. Same goes for Dragonite. So the jump, Tiger. Vision's down, they find GH. Call that out of the two of them. We'll get Miracle in on the back lines. He's able to find the commitment on... Sania will take out the Crystal Main. They're popping their BKBs here, Enigma. See if this makes any sort of a difference. It doesn't look to be. As uh, we are unable to finish off a target during his BKB, he's got to get back up to the high ground. Will manage to at least live. So no BKBs for Enigma. It's time for Team Liquid to go in. They still have that Aegis. Uh, they have another bear available. And we are. He goes down. Mikkei's able to jump in and pop it. Again. 
The second kill onto GH, he's out. No buyback on the two of them. Liquid, they'll just be able to clean them up one by one. Diving in, past the tier threes, past the tier fours. Boxy pushing them right back to the fountain. And he's gonna make sure that there's no chance for Enigma to step out here as Liquid. They can clear up the base, get each and every racks pretty much. With this time still 30 seconds with two members down on Enigma. Uh, Nig Nigma, pretty much the same story. What happened in the game one? Uh, stuck in the base, Team Liquid playing so aggressively, they get out of the laning stage with uh, a lot of advantage. And uh, yeah, I, I think this one's uh, also over. Like having Grimstroke as the offlane, they'll try it one more time. Now they're going all in on quite but can they quite burst him? They can. They will manage to bring down the Lone Druid. Is that going to allow them to get anything else done though in this fight? As the coils down, catches and takes out Kuroki. We are is able to move over to the back lines, find Insania. So that is two dead on Liquid. Mickey wants Mickey, to die. He's he very, wants to very use low. that Aegis. See if he wants to jump back in again. GH is looking for him with the Vendetta. Mickey still alive. Can GH at least take the Aegis out of his hands? He can. They take the Aegis away from the puck. They go for a second round. Tiger back in with the combo. And we are, but we are able to turn. Take out Tiger. Foxy. Pushing the Razor away, will combo him down with the, the Chakram and the Whirling Death. Now he's going to turn over towards GH. They just don't have the answer for this Timber, so like he can do whatever he wants. He can reset multiple times. Uh, like the only way you deal with him pretty much is to use Mana Burn on him. But he has Eternal Shroud, so he can get the, his mana back and be able to use the Timber Chain to get out of the trouble. So yeah, buyback from Koikwa. He wants to end this game. Yeah, they, he's going all in on it. As they'll take these racks, no trouble. Trouble at all there, as the melee am range removed from the bottom lane. Miracle trying to bring down the bear. He'll manage to do so. So bear gone, bit of gold here for Miracle. We've seen some comebacks, right? We have from, seen we, some We've comeback. seen some. And you know, for as much as we know, maybe that percentage rounds down. It could be a 0 0.1, you never know. Wait, I just realized that this puck coil is actually a Lotus from anime. It is, isn't it? The cosmetic. It, it is? Yeah. Well, there we go. I missed Puck's No spoilers. Not, not spoilers. You know, doesn't work on Spirit Breaker. But you can buy it. Sure. So you can look cool. <laughs> anyway, mid lane Miracle's gone. And uh, this time around, he doesn't have buyback. So Miracle down. Liquid up with the numbers. Five versus four. We should see Liquid try and close this one up now. Tier four was in the base. The ancient remaining. Tiger slides in. Gets the toss back onto GH as GH is out. Two dead, no buyback. Quifer's going to work with the bear on the towers. Put an end to this one. We are trying to charge in. Popping the BKB, trying to come in with the static lead, but they're able to break get it. Get Step back, get back in there with the bears. Weehard's got to run back to the fountain. They got the toss control from Tiger. Weehard does have buyback though. He's ready for another round of the defense. The ancient is exposed. Liquid, they'll look to close it. Enigma, they won't be able to stop it this time round. As GG is called, Liquid will take this second game.